Hi, my name is Merritt Thatcher. I'm CEO and co-founder of Argyle. We help construction go faster with fewer F-ups for projects like Eric's. Eric had a bad day on site when they poured concrete around a structural embed and it was a misplaced embed. The real frustration for Eric is they spent so much time and effort modeling this building prior to building it. Every detail is in here, but it's stuck in the office until Argyle. Argyle converts their model into an AR ready format so that Eric can see what's on site. Every single one of the different trades, electrical, pipe, structural is there. He can click on mechanical systems and see them load around him. He can walk the site and learn that we actually need two boxes, not one there. As Eric goes through the site, they're able to find errors proactively. They're actually able to prevent prevent errors and see what they're building prior to building it. Eric says the best part about this is no knowledge is needed. You take a first year, hand them Argyle, and 30 minutes later, they're back with the QA report, which couldn't come at a better time because right now we have major infrastructure and chip spending bills that are exacerbating a really tight labor market already. Construction needs to do more with less. So we're offering them a very affordable visualization option. We are offering AR immersion on commercially available headsets for 500 a month and an AR window on tablets like iOS for 100 a month. We have prepaid license revenue and off to a great start this year, 10K in January and 36K in February in prepaid license revenue. Now, <clears throat> Argyle's not the first people to bring BIM to the job site, but we're doing so in a way that is made to scale because it is user-friendly. And it has to do with our patented alignment technology. So this video shows double speed walk. We're going from a chemistry lab down the hall in this high school. You can see that we're not only compressing such a big model, but that model stays aligned as you walk through the site. This is only possible with our patented alignment techniques. So. JTM construction, how, how hard was it for them to get started in Argyle? They went from nothing to a sale in two weeks, taking 20 different uh, stakeholders throughout this new construction. And they caught design errors before they even began building. So now they're using Argyle on multiple projects, but they just found us with video online. It is clear from our video that Argyle is doing construction AR safer and smarter and faster than the competition. So we're driving people to our website for free trials, and that is how we're going to start tackling this problem here. Let's get 200 users in our first year. We're targeting project managers and superintendents on general construction sites and moving toward tradespeople. But beyond visualization, we're moving for construction intelligence to get early warning, classification, and forecasting on project sites that wouldn't be possible without this boots on the ground reality capture. My name is Merritt. I'm a third generation construction contractor and a former lawyer. Logan built this solution. He's the alignment inventor and he's a former building architect. We're Argyle. We go construct, we help construction go faster with fewer F ups. Thank you. All right. Thanks, Merritt. Okay. We'll start with you. Um, can you, uh, wait, 18, do we have your audio back? I think so. You tell me. Yeah, that's great. All right. Do you have a question uh, for Merritt? Yeah, Merritt, <laughs> actually, that sounded really nice. Um, it's obviously something that is, uh, that is needed right now. I guess my question to you is, are you, who are you selling to in the end, right? Because on the construction side, there's a bunch of different people that are responsible for different aspects. So who are you selling to? Who's your ideal customer? And how do you actually get access to them? All right. Thank you so much. Jay, question for Merritt. Yeah. Um, what's the remote capabilities of this? So it seems like you got someone on site, but is there also a way to stream this and leverage this in a remote environment? Awesome. Mark, how about you? Uh, yeah, uh, really cool. Uh, I'm curious about motivation to fix. Does the customer really want to know, you know, when things are off and, uh, you know, what that means for adoption and, uh, accuracy uh how do you how do you know that you're um how have you guys built the product for accuracy all right great let's take one from syndicate member alexander is asking can argyle help reduce carbon emissions of large construction sites so you have two minutes for those merit thank you all right uh, carbon emission question is great because concrete is one of the biggest emitters, and that was one of our first use cases in Argyle is saying, hey, let's stop chipping out concrete for mistakes. So a teen asked, um, you know, who are we selling to? The ideal customer for us and our entry point into the construction company is the virtual design and construction manager. They're the person in charge of making the building information model and indeed bringing all the different trades models into one cohesive unit. So if they have that person, that's our entry. 
that person is highly motivated because they love their model. That's what they're in. And it's very frustrating to them that it basically gets thrown away as soon as the document hits print. So another great part about this is that we're getting access to them because of our video and we're also doing outbound calls. So we can start to see customers are playing in the visualization realm. We're using that kind of intent data to uh, make our outbound calls. As far as remote capabilities, uh, short answer is yes, but it does rely on really good Wi-Fi or at least a good hotspot connection, which we found many, many construction companies do not actually have. So everything you saw was pre-downloaded to the headset because of our very small model compression. It does not rely on Wi-Fi or streaming in order to work. Um, that said, it is super cool when you can get a remote participant going, and we have been able to live stream Argyle in the past, which has been a lot of fun. Um, Mark, your question, is there a motivation to fix, and do they want to know? Ah, that has been the topic of some very interesting conversations we're having with customers. Like, is this, are, are they victims to this technology because they can't fix it before somebody sees it? And really that's not the case because it's able to be a conversation piece about what trade goes next, who's going to be in the way of whom. And it's, it's less about you're wrong and more about having a great conversation to begin with. So thank you. That's my time. I appreciate those questions.